Welcome back, everybody. Uh, this episode, we want to go change clothes, um, and then probably do a mission. And I was going to tell you about the furry story, but I finally remembered what I wanted to tell you about. So we have this new kid. He's the son of an employee that works there, and this employee's worked there for the longest amount of time as any employee who's ever worked there. She's worked there for almost six or seven years now. Mm-hmm. And long story short, these kids, because he works on day shift with a bunch of other 17, 16-year-olds, they're talking about their supposed sex life. Mm -hmm. And he said the worst thing he could ever make up. Now, I'm not saying the kid's lying, but the kid's lying. His story is his one and only time, which is like a, a week ago, because it's always a week ago. It was with a woman, but the rever ver the rules the rules were reversed. I'm saying he got pegged. He told everyone, everybody. He announced it to everybody. He got pegged, except his mom. Who will find out in a day or two that his son is saying he got pegged. So I'm just going to say, if you get pegged, please don't bring that up at the workplace. No, no, you don't bring that up ever. <laughs> you suppress that memory only to tell your psychiatrist or mental ward fucking doctor. Unless you're into that shit. I mean, God damn. I mean, I'm not going to kink shame, but just, I mean, if you're going to bring it up, yeah. why would you bring it up? Uh, yeah, you... Unless you're into, like... Specific humiliation at work where people laugh at you. But yeah. I thought I'd just bring that story up because it happened last night. And I forgot about it because I have that fucking Alzheimer's and can't remember fucking two minutes ago. Uh, but yeah, I remembered. I mean, Why the, the, the fuck? I don't know. I don't know. I mean,. It's the fact that I knew everybody was making that shit up, so... Fuck, I made something ridiculous up. Everybody actually believed me, that's the weird fucking part. Yeah, you know what, he... He himself said that that happened. Alright, let's go for a new hat. I just said driving down 100 mile an hour while Dale Earnhardt was fucking... Giving me the thumbs up and the fucking fire truck was on fire. Okay, what do you think of this hat? Oh, uh, it's not the hat I wanted. I look like a cancer patient. <clears throat> I shouldn't joke about that. Alright, go back. It's not what I wanted. <clears throat> so. Um, yeah. Do we not have a green cap? Are they just rags? They're all just rags. What's a watch cap? What do you think a watch cap is? Oh. You look like the fucking trainer I look like, from Rocky. I look like a hipster with my pink hair in this hat. I think I, I'm going with it. What do you think? Okay. Yeah, I don't... You, sir. You gotta make the rest of it look ridiculous. Oh, of course. Alright, we're gonna go to shirts now. Shirts. Torsos. Alright, got the white tank top, black tank top. Checkerboard. Uh, That's gonna be tacky as hell. Oh my god, that bitch is so tacky. That's not checkerboard. What do you mean checkerboard? Oh no, I think I saw something awesome. Okay, I'll go back. Or checkered. I don't know what the fuck. It's called a polo shirt, alright? No, it's called a flannel. Alright, what, what are you looking at? Combat jacket? Combat jacket, let's see. <clears throat> Oh my god, I look like a homeless person. I'm buying it. Yes! Now we just gotta have the... Okay, Thank now we need the shortest shorts possible to get in this game. We might already have them. I was thinking of actual pants this time. Yep. Oh my god. Mm. You know what I clicked. No. <laughs> yes! Do you think we should go with that or the black ones? Uh, let's find out. Let's just... Then we have to do something ridiculous with the shoes. Oh, 
Sadly, this game is made before Crocs. <laughs> oh, I can get my sweatpants. No, no, this is great. This is where the direction we're... I think I like the black better, actually. Yeah. Thank you, ma'am. All right, see so what kind of shoes we get. It's my garment. Got socks and sandals. Cowboy boots, flip flops. Socks and sandals sounds pretty awful. I'm really going for the homeless vibe with this one. <laughs> Yep. There's no <laughs> doubt about that. I'm proud of what we made here. Alright, we got more. We got chains, watches, and glasses. So Gotta have the most expensive. We have dog tail or African pendant. Let's, pendant. Let's try that one. I think dog tail look better. But we'll... we'll uh, dog yeah, tail. Dog try. tag. Excuse me. We'll see what this one is. This is the African pendant. Yes. <sighs> I feel like that's a little racist, but I sure. don't care. Sure, why not? Will you shut up? I don't like this girl talking to my ear. Alright, we got watches and glasses. Watches, we got pink watch or yellow watch. Let's see. I don't know if we'll be able to see it under the jacket, but we'll see. Yes. Sure. We gotta go with pink for the hair. Oh. What is this abomination we are creating? I don't know. It looks like... There's this one meme of this one guy. Don't know his name, but he looks just like him. I'll post a picture. So we got joke glasses, joke match, eye patch. What's this one doing? Should we see what joke glasses are first? Yes. And joke mask. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nah. Go back to him. Let's see what the joke mask is, and then we're going to probably get the, uh, Whatever I was just looking at. Oh, that hurt. Did you elbow yourself? The eye patch. Oh. I kind of like it. Yeah, me too. Oh, you're going to be the hamburglar. <laughs> Alright, I think we're done. The homeless crackhead hamburglar. Alright. I am proud of this. Do you come again? I look like the Flash. <laughs> God. All right, let's do the next mission. I like. Oh, I like the I like the breeze on my legs. At the right speed on a motorcycle, you get that breeze into your balls. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, brother. Alright, we can go to the W, which is Woozy. We can go to the C, which is, uh, Cunt? I don't know. Uh, we're not gonna do zero. We're gonna try not to do that. We also got wherever this. I think that's like a house for sale. I think that's it. Right, let's go to the Wee Woo. Alright, we'll see if we can do the Wee Woo. Uh, it's the Wee Woo C. C is the Wee Woo. Okay. Oh, that might be Officer Tenpenny. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. It's an O, and it just looks like a C. Damn. Fucking road burn. Oh, it's gonna be hard to take any it, cutscene it was, seriously it now. Was, it, was, it was hard earlier, but now it's gonna be very difficult. Can't you see I don't know how to drive when I'm <laughs> operating? Can you see I'm on mini drugs? <laughs> Sorry, ma'am. They're wrong to call a like, uh, crackhead pharmaceutically gifted. Probably. Okay. We're gonna save the game so we're in this outfit real yes. quick. Definitely. That is that is definitely recommended for your best <clears throat> performance of this game. Alright. Yeah. Let's go to the Sup. The cash is leaving Los Santos again. We're gonna have to let this one slide, man. Got too much shit on my plate. We could do it. Snail trail. I found a gay slit and snail hentai. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was horrifying. Gay slit. 
What's up? Hey, what's up, Jethro? Some cops are looking for you in the office, man. Oh, not the popo. <laughs> he really does look like the hamburger. Alright, man, I got it. <clears throat> nice to see y'all kicking back. I wonder how your brother's sleeping. Curled up next to his shower daddy while you lived comfortably on the outside. <laughs> Y'all want this? <laughs> well, what we want is to get on with our jobs in peace without some damn bleeding heart liberal. All <laughs> right, damn liberals. Look at me. Do I look like a liberal lubber? What the hell would you know about it, boy? Whoa, easy there, Eddie. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Some young journalist out there is trying to get a name for himself. He doesn't know how the streets work. That he's supposed to report what he's supposed to report. Yeah, anyway, we need you to shut him up for us. And that stoolie, shut him up too. Yeah, there's some reporter who's digging up dirt on Pulaski. We don't know who's talking, but we know the reporters meet next day. Take care of him. Oh, this is a nice place. Carl. Carl. <sighs> <laughs> and the sniper rifle in the construction site. Why not just hand it to me? We're literally inside of an enclosed building. He had less chance of getting caught in the building than he is putting it right here. And it was the 90s, there was no security cameras. Well, not good ones. Maybe that's why. Maybe he's scared that CJ would write him out. Like, CJ cares about going to the cops. Okay. This news reporter would be like, So, I had a... Follow that train. So, I guess we're just following the train? Not blowing it up? Alright. Imagine getting that news reported to you. Fucking naked homeless man with a gun about to kill you. I just gotta follow it. Not get hit by it. Not swerve in front of it. <laughs> I'm trying not to. I already would have three times just because that's I. I think it was funny. <laughs> I like the mask. I really do like the mask. <clears throat> I think I know who's going to be our next Fatman Rumble contestant. Yeah. CJ the Hamburglar. Gay Hamburglar. The homeless. Gay Hamburglar. Gay Hamburglar homeless on crack. The Gay on crack homeless Hamburglar. Let's check out the next stop. Are you supposed to pop him? No. Okay. Ooh, that was a close one. I think it's right around here. Oh my god. Uh, that's not good. Okay, I guess we'll just stay behind. It'll probably be safer. I like how no one's suspicious. 
Yeah, that's just Johnny the meth head. He does this every couple days. But he forgets where he's at. He just follows the train to find a way home. I say home, but it's really just a cardboard box. The Costco parking lot where he sucks dick in the bathroom for money. At the, at the, at the Costco parking lot where he sucks dick for money. Right next to the McDonald's where he steals hamburgers. Oh my god, oh my god. Pretty boy, thank you. Jump. Oh, I don't have to get, I have to get away from him? Okay, I guess we're leaving the bike here. Nice look for last year. Thank you. So that's the guy. I was going <laughs> to... <laughs> I guess in this city, there's nothing strange about this fellow. Until he starts following you, of course. Well, aren't we gonna pop him and... No, we gotta follow him. For the interview and then kill both of them. Oh. It's very fitting to be the hamburger. <laughs> it plays some fucking... Do -do -do -do. Fucking Pete Panther theme. It goes with the hair. Math, math. Math, math. Math, 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 Oh, the cop doesn't care I'm doing this. I'm doing this for the police, after all. Oh my god, why are you shooting me? You wrecked my shit. Oh my god, all because I stole a car. Calm down, people. Oh my god, I wasn't even that far away. It's literally right here. <sighs> Math. You hit my bike with your car, bro. He's <laughs> dog the bounty hunter. <laughs> I can't wait to get our Fat Man plushie. I'm glad I got my shirt finally. Is that what you're wearing? Yeah. Oh, it's the back patch. The thing on the back. Oh. It's a car thing. Oh, really? You tell me the car on the back is a car thing? Taxi strat. No, no. Oh, damn. Taxi strat. Oh, my God. Fine, we'll drive a fucking taxi. Why does it always work, though? Maybe we'll make him go into our taxi. I'm thinking about buying a new laptop eventually. Mm-hmm. Even though I love this thing. It's lasted... Since we did our first video, it was on this laptop. <clears throat> like, like, almost three years ago now? Yeah. Damn, bro. <clears throat> Time to update a little bit. Cool, I was trying to get behind him, so I was waiting. Slow ride, brah, brah, take it easy. What's a cop?
look at it. Hello, doggy. Our dog walked in. My dog walked in. Oh my god, cops, what are you doing? Why do I have to follow the traffic laws, but you don't? Just kidding, I don't follow traffic laws in this game. You barely follow traffic laws in real life. What? Just shut up. Shut up. Just because I go 110 and a 55 doesn't mean I'm a lawbreaker. Hey, you drove my truck to work last night. I'm just sitting there in your car and you're like, WANG! Yeah. Nigga guy got a little too close for comfort. Yeah I, yeah, I haven't been able to make my truck make the sound that you did. When was this? Like, when I was doing the uh, AC motor. I mean, the uh, blower motor. Yeah. And I took it in the shop to get it done and you drove my truck to work. Yeah. Yeah, then. Really? Oh, yeah, I was in front of you. Oh. Yeah, I, I, I've never been able to make that truck make the sound that you did. I don't think it was that bad. Maybe it's just the way I heard it and it sounded awesome. Maybe it sounds. Oh. How do you zoom in? Alright. Oh, oh, I shot one? Are you serious? That's crazy. I didn't mean to shoot one. I meant to figure out how to zoom in. No scope. No one paying. No, there was a scope, just not very good. There's not a way for him to escape, right? There's open fire. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's how you take care of that. Shoot him in the goddamn face. Punch that motherfucker. Oh my god. What'd I do? You're in the wrong neighborhood. Apparently. Can I have a chili dog? Yo, fucking there's... Are they mad because I'm a Nicholas homeless man? Alright, well we're gonna save the game. Somewhere there'll be a thing to save the game. Uh, the great places that your tax money go in Los Santos. Oh, I almost said something very terrible. <laughs> I'm not gonna say that. No. I guess I'll censor it. <laughs> Alright, where is the closest save? And then we'll end today's episode. I think San Andreas or Old Home is the closest save, possibly. I don't know if you're able to go down in the city. I could. Yeah, you can now. <laughs> Unless we want to like buy a house. That's a lot of money. Sweaty. Yeah, we're gonna go back home and save the game. And that's how it went today's episode. And the next episode, we'll have to drive all the way to where the missions are. Jesus. <clears throat> yes. PlayStation what wonderful go. drive. What wonderful drive. Can you get taxis in this game? I think so. That would be helpful. But I guess we'll just take the ambulance home. Kill me because of you are horrible. Your mama must be proud of your driving, fool. Your mama must be proud of your driving, fool. <laughs> God, that's my jammer clip. When you got hit by an ambulance? Yes. Yeah. Great. You can't even kill me because you are horrible. Ah. <sighs> 
don't know what my favorite Jimmy clip is. Oh, I did find something else I'm gonna buy. Mm. I don't know why I'm buying a bunch of plushies, but there's a giant rat that makes all the rules plushie. That car just drove off the interstate, by the way. Anyway, yeah, there's a giant rat that makes all the rules plushie. I'm gonna buy it next month, I think. He makes all the rat rules. Rats, rats, we are rats. Appreciate that. Thanks. Rats, rats, we are rats. I'm the giant rat that makes all of the rules. Let's see what kind of trouble we can get ourselves into. <laughs> <laughs> so, so shit. Mm, I love it. Oh, we can have we can fuck. Next episode we'll fuck, and then we'll go back to do the missions. All right, here's a good place to park the ambulance. Okay. <laughs> Ricky has nothing to say to any of this. No, not really. All right, I think the saves in the house. Yeah, it is. The Johnson house. Ricky doesn't like, like that name. Why? Why do you not like Johnson? I don't know. Why do you not like Johnson, Ricky? I'm not gay. I'm glad he got the joke. All right, and that's how we'll end today's episode. My Anything? ass hurts. That's how we're going to end today's episode. His ass hurts. Bye, everybody. Bye.